गुड मॉर्निंग गाइज माई टॉपिक इज मोबाइल एप्लीकेशन लैंग्वेज एक्स एम एल ओके फॉर प्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ एनी वॉट इज एक्स एम एल वी ऑल नो ओके फॉर प्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ एनी टैक्स सिंबल वी यूज एक्स एम एल ओके सर सपोज इन एग्जाम्पल सपोज इन कैप्सुलेटेड टैक्स और एनी थिंग ओके प्रोसीड डिस्प्लेड और प्रिंटेड एज पर टेक्स ओके वी यूज एक्स एम एल Uh, so in XML basically what it does is that it encapsulates the data, okay, and made data but can represent the behavior. XML document, uh, <clears throat> a text with the tags. The XML document has an extension .xml. A tag in the document specifies the meaning of the text encapsulated within the uh, within the tag, okay. Uh, for presentation of the marked textual content, an encapsulated text processed. Displayed or printed as per tag a browser for the presentation. This is the basically basic use of markup language. Uh, so XML basically what does XML do? Not only encapsulates the data and metadata but can represent the behavior or set of actions. So basically XML uh, this, uh, shows the behavior actions or whatever it is. XML document a text within with the tags. Okay, what does it do? Is that when whenever there are two tags, it documents the text between that. Okay. Uh, so an extension XML document has that is dot XML that we all know. Uh, so what extensible markup language is the derivative of SGML that is standard generalized markup language. Extensible. What does it mean? That it extends. Special instance of the tag. Basically, the tag we can define by ourselves. It is not defined, predefined. Okay. So this is the basic use of extensible markup language. Uh, so an XML based language is SyncML, Pandamo, Pandambol, and Smile. Okay. So in this example, so in this example we can see that contacts is there. All names first character O. What does all name first character O does is that it just takes all the characters that is name record Oxford University it is address that is great calendar street Oxford OX2 6DP address. So basically what is the, what is does that this attribute first character value O that it, it takes all the values which has the first character O and finds out all the records that is name record is a different tag address is a different tag telephone number is a different tag all this okay. So this is also the same example here. We are just opening the record of a guy known as Raj Kamal. Okay, A B C address is there, telephone number is there, name record is there. This is a contact record. All this. Okay. Huh. So XML document representation of a database. Okay. In a database, how could XML document be represented using tags and a pair of start and end tag in the document specifies the start and end of a record in a database. We all know that thing. That is the starting and the ending shows the according to database. A database used to retrieve the specific record or set of records by querying the database. So we can basically query anything and we just we can just take the records. Okay. The element name, record address, and telephone number. Suppose Raj Kamal was there, two elements A, B, C, and telephone number. Document form by XML document creating a database name contacts. Okay. So this is the same example. Name record Raj Kamal, A, B, C Street, address, telephone number. This telephone number name record. A tag can represent a command. Okay, for processing the data using the command name within the pair of start and end tags means a tag can represent also a command. A tag along with its attribute can specify the command source file and data to process the command. Okay, this is what when data is modified. For example, new email or newly downloaded music file. The see what happens is that the uh, computer basically gives an command okay so what happens is that, that suppose you have a new downloaded music file the computer gives a command the server alerts the client so that the client can synchronize its data with the modified data command means any alert which is given by the computer or any pc or anything okay a number with cmd reference refers to a notification which the computer gets in place of transmitting full text of the server notification for alerting the client only a number is sent the client at the other end interprets the notification and from the referred number. Command refers to a command referred by one with CMD reference and CMD reference. Okay, that is command CMD reference is open like this and closed like this. Okay, message reference is also open like this and closed like this. The tag and attributes together represent the system behavior. Command is audio 
attribute id specifies the user id that is my id okay here my here the command is any audio that is your computer uh, might be at risk suppose any command comes from the computer side this is what is a my audio dot wave okay attribute src specifies the source file that is my my audio dot wave attribute begin specify zeros time from the start and playing to the audio this means that this audio will run from 0 second to 10 seconds okay so this is also the same thing that is audio will run from 0 to 10 seconds document type definition that we all know that DTT DTT is not specific to be mean made for every documents okay if you are totally aware of the document then only you have to make about DTT for small small projects you don't need to make any DTT DTT is basically used for big, bigger projects in which you are using XML for a bigger project then only you have to make DTT okay functions of DTT to enable uh, validations of a document to specify which document structures can be specified all this okay so this is a basically functions of the parser parser we know that is used to pass from the top to bottom there are many there are two approaches to top to bottom bottom to up we all have studied in internet programming okay this is what is the use of parser validation document validation is quite necessary for investigating the authenticity of the document if the document is authenticated we need to validate it so this is the basic purpose of document type definition okay it is basically used to validate the document whether it is correct or all the informations are same as what you have done in the previous all this okay the header information the version encoding and reference to other files validation which is also important external DTD and internal DTD to are there okay parsers do you have you have k xml parser dot uh, net xml parser Two modes are there, SACS approach, DOM approach, we all know that. Summary, extensible markup language, XML document, text with the tags, attributes in the tag, XML tag, in the document specifies the meaning of the text encapsulated with the start and corresponding end tag. So in short, what we learned about XML is that it is a basic, the same XML which you used to in the past. XML is basically used for Android purpose, all this. So we have done. Thank you.